Hey everyone, I'm Kate Schwenke and welcome to my channel. Today I have a review and packing video for you guys featuring this beautiful Lily Jade Jennifer tote from their lifestyle collection. Lily Jade's lifestyle collection offers bags that you can use every day anywhere. You can use them for travel, you can actually use them as diaper bags if you have an insert. You can also use them as diaper bags without an insert. And as you guys requested, I have this bag packed up without an insert. And I also have it packed up for baby wearing because I wanted you guys to see just how much you can actually fit in this bag. So I have the Lily J. Jennifer here in the brandy color. Brandy is an absolutely gorgeous shade of brown. It's more of a reddish brown, and it's this deep, rich leather, which is full grain and gorgeous, so soft and smells amazing. With this color, you have the beautiful gold zippers, gold nameplate, the gold Lily Jade bead here, and then you have your jade beads. It's just, it's so pretty. So in this video, I've already done a quick review over on my unboxing, and I'll link it right here for you guys. So this video is more of a packing video, and then you guys can see all the features up close, and I will talk a little bit more about the bag too. So let's go ahead and get started. As you guys saw in the very beginning of this video, this bag can be worn as a tote, so I have these two nice tote straps here. They're full leather, and they have an amazing drop length on them. And if you're not using these, you can just fold them in the front of the bag to keep them out of the way. And then you can also use this bag, I'll show you guys here in the back, as a backpack using the messenger strap that comes with this bag. You can also wear it messenger style and over the shoulder, as you guys saw in the first part of the video. And convertible diaper bags are my favorite because you can use them in so many different ways. This bag in particular, I feel would be amazing for travel, like on an airplane, or wherever you want to go and having the option to be able to carry this on your back is amazing. I love that. You also have the D-rings on the sides here so you can wear this bag over your shoulder and messenger style. This is one of Lily Jade's larger bags. As you guys could probably see in my on the body video at the beginning, I am 5'2 and 128 pounds so and this bag is good size on me. But even though it's a bigger bag, it is still super comfortable. There's something about the way that Lily Jade straps are made, but no matter how big their bags are, um, they're still just so comfortable to wear on the back. And I feel like the way that they design this bag is just everything inside feels evenly distributed when you wear it in a backpack style. So I really love that. On the back here, as you guys can see, you have one long zipper. This is a great pocket to store your straps in if you are not using the strap. And I actually have something else in here and I'll show you guys in just a minute. Um, but let's go ahead and start with the front of the bag. So this pocket here in the front is a great place to store your phone and other things that you want to get to quickly. So in here I have my iPhone 8 Plus. That fits in there great. I also have two small set pieces from Jujubee. I have my Queen of the Nile and here I have just some medical supplies and things like Advil, band-aids, ointments, and things like that. I also have one more small set piece, and this is in whimsical watercolor, which I think looks really great with this particular bag. In here I just have things for me like hand cream, a mirror, some lip gloss, hair ties, and things like that. As you guys might be able to see with this particular color, the brandy, you actually have that beautiful jade lining. I mean, it's seriously one of my favorite colors, so it's it's just so stunning. And the actual lining on this bag, the fabric that they use is so soft and it feels so high quality. I just, I love their linings. So that is the very front of the bag. The back of the bag's not too different. And as you guys can see, the sides don't actually have anything going on, but you do have this really cool design on the bottom here. I also wanna mention while I'm over here, but you do have these amazing metal feet on the bottom of the bag. These just keep the bottom of your bag a little bit more protected if you sit the bag on the ground. I personally always try to keep mine levitated <laughs> just in case because I like to baby my Lily Jade bags like big time. So, um, But if you do set it on the ground, you'll have a little bit more protection. So I love that. So on the very back of the bag, as I showed you guys before, there's your backpack straps. I'm going to move those out of the way a little bit. So this pocket is actually the perfect size to store a change pad. As I mentioned, this is their lifestyle bag, so it does not come with an insert, it doesn't come with a change pad, it's made for more everyday life, work, and things like that. But I am making it work as a diaper bag, and it's actually great. So here we go. Check this out, guys. I have a full memory foam change pad in here by Jujubee. Perfect size. This is from a BFF. 
Um, so this is the perfect fit in here. I didn't have any trouble putting it in or taking it out and it fits like, like a glove guys, seriously, look at that. Look at that. And it's memory foam and this part goes on your back. So that's what I had in this pocket is a memory foam change pad. And that's all that I have on the outside of the bag. So let's go ahead and jump on to the inside for the packing portion. So this is what the top of the Jennifer looks like. You have just this one nice long zipper that goes all the way across and all the zippers on Lily Jade open up so nicely. So there you go. You also have a leather zipper pull on the end there. So this is basically what I have going on on the top here. As you can see, it's just, um, it doesn't look super organized, but that is because I have a jacket laying right on top. Now remember, I do not have an insert in this bag for this video as requested, but you can purchase those separately and I'll make sure to link everything down below, the bag, insert, and everything that I use in this video will be down below so you guys can shop through those links. So the main compartment of the Lily J. Jennifer is pretty much just empty space and then you have a couple of tech pockets and one zippered pocket that is lined in leather. So I will go over that after I empty everything out. So the first thing I'm going to do is take off this jacket. So this is actually packed up for my 18 month old and myself for baby wearing, as I mentioned. So I just have a winter jacket for him and that is an 18 month size and I just had it laying across the top of everything in here. Now you guys can see a little bit better how I have this organized. As a lot of you know, I am actually a minimalist, so I don't have a ton of stuff in here, just the necessities for baby wearing while I'm out and about with my son. So I also have my keys on the key fob over here. I'm gonna go ahead and take those off. I love having a key fob on the inside of the bag, especially with a bag that has a lot of empty space inside. It's great to be able to find your keys right away. So that's all I had on there. In this GGB large set piece here, I have a change of clothes for my son. I have some socks, I have a sweater, and I have a little pair of pants for him. That's all that I had in there. Next to that, I have a medium set piece by GGB, and in here I just have a few little toys for him. He has some teething toys, he's still chewing on stuff, and just a few gadgets that he likes. He loves these for some reason. And a couple of Hot Wheels cars, so that's the kind of stuff he's into, and I'll just bring those with me to keep him busy. Now you guys can probably see what I have down in here for baby wearing. I have my Lilla Baby Organic Complete Carrier right here and that fits great at the length of the bottom of the bag and it keeps everything that I need to reach quickly a little bit higher up out of the bag and if I need to get this, it's not hard to remove that stuff to get to it. So I really like that. Also, if you guys wanna see how I have this folded, I will link a video right here for how I fold this to fit into my bags. Also next to that, I have Lily Jade's medium size packing case in the khaki. These cases are so nice, guys. I cannot say enough good things about them. I love them, they are so nice. So in here, I actually am using this as a diapering bag. So I have a Y pouch 30 in here for my wipes. And then I have three size four diapers in there as well. And I kind of like having a clear front to this so that I can keep track of how many diapers I have left. So I really like that for those. Next to that, I have a GGB Be Quick here. And here I have loads of snacks because this is also packed out for a fairly long day with my son. So here we go. I have a juice over here, Apple and Eve. I have a couple snacks some Nature Valley biscuits, Nature Valley oatmeal squares. My kids are obsessed with those right now. And then we also have a fruit pouch. My son loves to snack. <laughs> and then I also have some Cheerios and an Inno Baby snack tower. So that's all that I had in my Be Quick. Works really great to tote snacks around. Now let's see, I also have my happy planner and I have been loving this planner. It's so nice and small, personal sized, so it fits in diaper bags great. Perfect for on the go. And so now that's pretty much all that I have left in here, guys. I have my wallet sitting over here in this larger pocket. This is a tech pocket right next to that, but this wallet is a Kate Spade Care wallet and it fits really great in that pocket there. I don't like to keep my wallets in the front pockets just in case I am wearing this on my back and somebody grabs something out of there. You never know what's gonna happen. So I like keeping my wallets more on the inside of the bag. So that is pretty much what you have in here and I will show you guys, this is how I have my Lilla Baby Carrier set up. 
This is how I have it. And um, it just fits perfect at the bottom of this bag here. And so this is the inside of the Jennifer. It is huge, it's amazing, and I can totally see myself using this as like a travel weekend bag for myself. So I love it. And then you have this leather trimmed pocket I mentioned earlier. This is a great place to store your keys if you do not want to use the key fob. So that is my review and packing video for the Jennifer guys. I hope you enjoyed it and found it helpful. And if you did, please give this video a big thumbs up and definitely subscribe while you're here if you're new. Lily, Jade, and I are going to be teaming up for 2019 to bring you guys some more awesome reviews. And let me know down in the comments below what Lily Jade bag you'd like to see reviewed next on my channel. Also, a big thank you to Lily Jade for sending this bag over for review. I love it. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.